Hi, I'm Dr. James Stusen, and I'm a plastic surgeon in Miami, Florida, and I'm also the co-editor of the journal Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery. I want to tell you about an article that's appearing in this month's journal. I think that will be very interesting to you. Uh, it is an article by two very well-known Belgian plastic surgeons, Dr. Alex Verapel and Patrick Tenard, and what it involves is using their technique for minimally invasive treatment to improve uh, sun-damaged skin and get rid of wrinkles and get rid of uh, uh, sun damage pigmentation without having to undergo any type of deep treatment such as uh, laser or chemical peeling. Uh, this technique involves the use of nanofat. And nanofat is uh, a substance that where you do a liposuction of fat, you remove the fat cells and you're left with just the growth factors and stem cells that exist within the fat aspirate. And then they combine that with microneedling, and microneedling is a series of small punctures by very small needles into the skin, and it creates microchannels where the nanofat is then delivered into the upper layer of the dermis. And it is a very interesting paper in that when they deliver the nanofat into the upper layer of the dermis, you get a regenerative effect. The sun damaged skin appears to heal, and over a period of two to three months, looks younger. The texture is improved, the wrinkling is improved, and the pigmentation associated with chronic sun damage seems to go away. And they do this again without ablative treatments like laser and chemical peeling, which have a lot of recovery. And in their hands, most of their patients are healed within 48 hours, go back to work with a little makeup, and they see the maximum effect at two to three months. Many of the minimally invasive techniques we have today to improve sun-damaged skin require multiple treatments, but according to these Belgian plastic surgeons, one treatment is often sufficient uh, in their patient. So I'm very excited about this technique. We're hoping that the readers of Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery start offering this technique uh, to their patients, and we hope it improves the appearance of photo age or some damaged skin without the typical recovery process that is required in more traditional treatments.